Now, I know I've been posting a lot about my fasting and things of that nature, and I haven't really posted anything on my blog. By the way, I do want to apologize for that, for not going live and not posting any updates about my fasting. Now, I have to understand. Well, it, no, I do have to understand, but just want you guys to understand. I haven't felt the desire to do so. I mean, I don't know what's been going on. I've been trying to research and figure out what's been going on with me. It turns out a lot of Aquarius people going on. Alicia, aren't you an Aquarius? Tell me if you agree with what I'm going through right now. I'm undergoing a spiritual transformation and awakening. And I'm also contemplating the future of this channel. You know, my nonsense level and the fact that, you know, no one seemed to help me. I don't have the money to, you know, hire lawyers. I don't have the money to hire a private detective. I get, I got several price quotes. The lowest I was able to get is um, $900. And I don't have that. I don't even have $900. So my, all my money goes on bills, food, and daughter school and whatever. So I don't have the extra necessities to just, oh, here's nine here. No big deal. What's a G, okay? I don't have those luxuries, unfortunately. Even after all the work I put on this channel, I'm practically doing this for free. Like I told my daughter or like I told whoever, I'm doing this because this is my portal for now to communicate with you guys until I actually get out on the street. I'm going to have to go old school to spread my word and make a living. Okay, I'm being blacklisted. Someone literally went and alerted all temp agencies, any, I don't know, conglomerate, government jobs or whatever, they literally alerted them of my name. How I know because someone leaked information to me. I don't know who did that. Screw my resume and degrees my record-breaking awards and recommendations that I got from members and colleagues from these jobs who I still speak to right now. You know, someone has money and seriously trying to blacklist me. And I'm not lying, this is for real. And I'm wondering why they're doing that because what I might saying and doing that other people aren't saying and doing. I don't see why I'm being you know, picked apart. I never couldn't understand in all the years of my life. You know, even with my family, when I was growing up, I was always picked out and stood out and picked apart and picked on. And I'm thinking, okay, why are we trying to lay back in the cut and be invisible as possible? Isolated solitude is what I thrive on, to be honest. You know, but it is what it is. And like I said, I'm not making any money on here and I, my views aren't real. I figured that out. I was able to manipulate the views at some point. It's like they have me on some sort of salary, which is like 200 and some a month. As far as I get, most I ever get was $289. I reached a point in my life where I'm considering calling it quits and starting new, like get rid of this channel, get rid of the Truth Show Live, the Truth Show All Love, get rid of all that crap. And just let karma take its course. With those who are sabotaging and stealing from me, I'm just so emotionally drained and, and I feel like I'm fighting against whatever, whoever is doing this to me. I'll just let my gens and guardians take care of whoever's doing this to me. Because at this point, whoever doing this to me, you're dead to me. Okay? And just consider this a warning because I'm done. And I just want you guys to know where I'm at right that with that whole situation and the fact that I haven't really, you know came up on camera. I mean, other than the fact that I lost weight, I still look the same. It's nothing dramatically different. Still wear kind of the same hairstyle. Y'all see the pictures I put up there? My little thumbnail at the top of my two show page. That's how I look if I wear a lot of makeup, which I don't do. So those glam shots are very rare. I don't wear all that damn makeup. I just wore those makeup for those head shots. But um, no, y'all know how I look. It's nothing changed other than I lost weight. That's it. Nothing's really that different. Um, more, more weight anyway. So with that said, now we got that out of the way. Okay, so hold up before I go back, before I go into the show. Alicia, now you said you're going through the same transformation because I researched it and, and I researched that a lot of Aquarius are feeling this, I don't know, this spiritual transformation, some kind of whatever. Believe it or not, the percentile for Aquarius who are isolating themselves is so high. It seems that during this age of Aquarius, a lot of Aquarius are isolating. Unless you have to go to work or you, know, you got to pay bills. I mean, you got to make a living, you know. But most of them prefer to be isolated. 
You know what I'm saying? So it's really, I don't know. I don't know what's been going on. Like for, I just been going spiritual, I, you know, me reading more about history. And then I want to go to the next step, not just reading, actually, you know, living it. I want to be a book smart person. I actually want to have accolades where I actually meet these people and go to these places, not just read them in the book. I want to touch it. You know what I'm saying? So I want to go further with my research so I can have something personal when I do start speaking to people in a more broader sense, you know? So, but I've been noticing that a lot of Aquarius are going through some spiritual stripping process. I, oh, so you don't like going outside? Oh, thank you, Damon. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I don't really believe that, but thank you. Okay, now you said I don't, you said I don't even like, for real? I know, right? I don't even like going outside. I mean, my husband, daughter, my husband wanted to go to the lakefront. I, got going, I like going to the lakefront, but I didn't want to go to the lakefront. I didn't even feel like going. I wasn't doing nothing. The day was beautiful. <laughs> I didn't want to go. I was like, I don't want to go to the beach. Oh, I should have said beach, not lakefront. I'm sorry. I, still, I know it's the ocean, but I still say lakefront, but I should just say the beach. I've been saying that forever. <laughs> Remember, I wasn't born in Los Angeles. I wasn't born here. Well, I don't know about the energy being negative. It's just been heavy. Not negative, just heavy. You know, you know, I'm an empath and other things that I've been meditating. And I don't know. It's just, uh, I don't know what's going on. It's just really crazy. It's just, oof. I can't be around a lot of people. I can't be around a group of people. That'll drive me crazy. For real, Damon? What is your sign, Damon? I, I'm sure you told me before. What are you, a Pisces or something? Taurus? Who was a Taurus? Oh, that was Nap. Nap was a Taurus. Okay. Somebody was a Taurus. Okay, let's move on with the show. 